Okay, everybody, thanks for watching another One Minute Wisdom from Interchrome Dental Lab. Today, we're going to talk about the photograph we need to be able to use it within the real view engine inside of Three Shapes Denture Design Module. The first thing you want to do is start with a really big smile. Get that full face, um, full frontal view of a smile of your patient, revealing as much anatomy of the try-in as possible so that we can go into the software using this tool and place points on all these anatomical landmarks in embrasures, cusp tips, zenus of gingiva, middle of the teeth. Once we're able to properly align the photo with the design from the previous try-in, we can then start to make some changes. This patient at try-in is showing a lot more tooth than they're accustomed to with their present denture. So with this tool, we're able to go in and bring the incisal edge up so that we don't have as much tooth display for this patient. We can still make sure that it follows the lower lip line. If we need to make adjustments to midline, we're able to do it with this tool. We're able to move it to the left, to the right. We're able to adjust for uh, the buccal corridors by shifting the entire setup left, right. There's a lot of different tweaks that we can make with this tool. The great thing about this function is that once you've tried this method and you can see the accuracy that it gives you, you can make a more educated decision about if you need to do another try-in. Ultimately, it's going to save you time and it'll make you look like a hero to your patients.